ready? And there's a couple things I wanted to show you here that I thought was 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 pretty neat, and it, it, it's on both sides. The first one is the white strips. When these trees are young, we have to protect them against mice because when the mice eat off that bark, they're getting to that layer that they can really damage and kill trees. Okay, so you use this. So to cover? that that would be one way of trying to uh, when the trees are are small to be able to cover them to where the mice maybe will try to stay away from them. Mice are a horrible pests. Really? Just like they're in a home. I think I have some in my apartment. Yeah. And uh, so, but the other one here on this tree that's kind of neat, and, and both conventional growers, uh, conventional growers and organic growers, this is called a pheromone trap. And are pheromones those chemicals that attract certain animals? That's correct. Animals? That's very good. Uh, not insects. Okay. So, I've heard of pheromone perfume or something. Uh, that it's the same. Uh, it's the same idea. Uh, what we have here is that we've been able to reproduce the sex scent of the female in some of these insects. Wow. And so what we do is it's got the sex scent. It's in this trap right here. And if you can notice here, you can kind of touch it right there. It kind of bear, don't touch, just get a little bit. Oh, you can yeah. see the sticky. Yeah, it's really sticky. So what we do with the, uh, the research entomologists and, and with the people who study bugs in this case, what they do is they let our growers, because we have newsletters, mm -hmm. we send out our newsletters out to people and email and other things, and we say, okay, growers, these insects that are fixing to feed on your apples, these, in, these insects that are feed, gonna feed, feed on your tomatoes or whatever, they're out. So you kind of track the population? That's exactly right. What I wanna show you here is these weeds are dying. And one of the things on the organic side, since we don't have a lot of good herbicide, is a weed killer. And weeds, are, weeds take zap so much in of a plant that that's and the organic side is probably one of the areas that we're lacking products to help us. So why are these weeds dying? Then? Because these were heavily mulched. If you take uh, leaves, you take bark. You know, you, you see the compost at the at the stores mm -hmm. in the bags. So yeah. what we would do then is layer this over here. So are you just covering the You're weeds covering so they them up. That's it, right. Uh, and then they die. Uh, Can you see this black right here? Yeah, is that a net or something? It's a weed barrier. So, there oh, it is. Wow. You can see it right there. So oh, there's all kinds of bugs. It's, it's like there. a plastic uh, well yeah, because the it's the ground is full of bugs. There's billions of seeds out here. Okay, and billions. you just don't want them to get through the cloth. And this is one way organically. It's just one way that we would try to help to keep the weeds. <laughs> 